hello youtube viewers thank you for tuning into my channel today and i am filming my own yard sale here while my hobby is mowing the lawn back there i haven't had any luck it's already like 12 something and maybe like two cars came by and no one even stepped out of their cars i priced everything it took me a lot of time this morning to set up. I'm selling a house over there. I'll take you up close so that you can see everything. But I'm selling a house because I have the gigantic dollhouse. And now it's like, uh-oh, what do I do? Where do I put them? So I really don't have the space. But if I don't sell it, I'll still bring it back in the garage. And my granddaughter, who's coming today, actually, she can play with it before I donate it. Because she has other dollhouses, too in my house so then i have here the snow blower so this is the snow blower it's 550 for a snapper heavy duty snow blower and um let's see the details on the, on it it's a 24 inch so it's 550 i'm sure that it's negotiable so but my hubby will take care of that if somebody's interested and then I have a table here. Let me show you first the vintage table and lamp that I have here. This used to be my mom's and it's a dual lamp. So you can either have it lit in the bottom or have it lit on top. And I have it there for $40. The table is also $40, marble on top. And then there's a heater for $20, perfect condition. We have a mirror here for $10, mint condition. It used to be my mom, but I just can't keep everything. I mean, she had so many things. Then I also have shoes here. The shoes are $2 a pair. Then I have some dresses here that don't fit me anymore. So depending on the length, that's the price but it's probably like 20 25 dollars and then i have this sweater here <laughs> excuse me this sweater i have too many sweaters at home and i don't even wear sweaters then i have all these books here the books are a dollar and the magazines are three for a dollar uh what else there's a lampshade over there for seven dollars So what I'm going to do is, since it's already 12 by 115, if I haven't had any traffic of people, I'm going to pack up the books, the magazines, maybe the clothing and the stuff on the table and I'm going to go run to the thrift shop before they close. Then I have some clothing here that doesn't fit my granddaughter anymore and my own clothing too have some pants here ladies clothing three dollars each that means you would get you would get these pants look at that great condition for three dollars look at that they even have a nice little design there some green ones look at how pretty this is I have a bag of ties. There's like four ties in there for four dollars. Bookends for three dollars. An antique book here for a dollar. These used to be my mother's um, holiday glasses. So there are nine here. I priced them five dollars for all nine. In mint condition, they're not chipped or anything like that. This little pack of nails, a dollar, and these magnets, a dollar. <sighs> So it was a lot of work bringing all this out, bringing the tables out, and I kind of don't want to do it anymore, you know. Oh, and then I didn't show you this. I have a clown here, a vintage clown, $6, and I paid a lot more for it a long time ago at a, at a flea market. Then here's like a little jewelry box. It's kind of weird in the front. I don't even know. I bought it, I think, because I wanted it. I wanted it for Halloween. That's what it was. But I'm selling it for two dollars. Look at that little birdhouse, a brand new cap, 
three daughters. So yeah, so I think that this will be it. Um, I will be packing things up soon. Oh, and that's the dollhouse over there. It's partly furnished with handmade items. This is the one that has that poker chip kitchen. Alrighty, well, I think that this will be it. Thank you for your time and thank you for watching.